Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the video I've been dying to make for a very long time. The GTA remasters are real. GTA 3, Vice City and San Andreas are being remastered on the Unreal Engine and will have a mix of new and old graphics. Current release date for it is planned to be at late October slash early November and because the 20th anniversary of GTA 3 will be on October 26th, I wouldn't be surprised if Rockstar is currently aiming to have it released by then. So can release on the exact release date of when it first came out 20 years ago. In terms of platforms, it will be releasing on the PS4, PS5, Xbox One, Xbox Series X, Xbox Series S, Nintendo Switch, and Stadia, with PC and mobile likely coming at a later date. The games are being remastered by Rockstar Dundee, which was previously Ruffian Games, who was responsible for Crackdown 2 and 3, and also assisted with development for the Master Chief Collection. For those not familiar with the Master Chief Collection, it's a remaster of all the Halo games, I think all the way up until Halo 3. Correct me if I'm wrong there. Ruffian Games was acquired about a year or so ago by Rockstar, so that's what I've been working on for the past year plus. And of course, this does also mean that they will not be the only one working on this. There will definitely be a lot more support from other studios as well as, you know, the watchful eye being put on them to make sure that they're not gonna fuck up what is three very legendary games. And obviously people are gonna have microscope levels type of zooming in to make sure that their beloved games are not being ruined by some studio who makes Crackdown 3. Jokes aside for a second, some more information from the Kotaku article where all this information is coming from. And yes, it's not been officially confirmed just yet. However, having heard some whispers myself and just basically other sources coming out of the work who we know are uh, trusted such as test 2 etc etc we can be pretty certain that this is going to be a thing one Kotaku source claims that they have seen a snippet of the games in action and said that the visuals reminded them of a heavily modded version of a classic GTA title think all those mods that have been taken down because take two wanted to make some money the UI of these games have been updated too, but will still retain the same classic style. No details were shared about gameplay, but Kotaku was told that those remastered titles are trying to stay true to the PlayStation 2 era GTA games as much as possible, which probably means that you won't be seeing Cloud talking or Tommy swimming, for example. I, that's what I'm assuming is going to happen, because they're pretty core gameplay visuals, I suppose, and I don't think they want to mess with those feelings too much. Though I hope there will definitely be some quality of life things added to the game, for example the auto aim system in GTA 3 and Vice City is quite trash, really hope that they will improve upon that, and maybe some other quality of life things added to the game to make it feel like still like the PS2 era, but at the same time also be a little bit more playable for its current day and time. For example being able to use R2 and L2 for driving would be a nice touch for me, mainly because I'm so used to it now in GTA a5 but those are just minor things i think like having small little modern things added to the game to really make it a bit more usable i guess for its current uh, time because obviously especially the console versions of the gta games are a little bit on the rougher side in this day and age when it comes to controllability as for my thoughts on this personally i am very excited to finally be able to talk about this and actually have some more details actually being brought out about it because i'm very much looking forward to getting my hands on these new remasters it's honestly something that i didn't really expect that were actually going to be a thing i mean obviously like i said i've you know, heard so the whispers were getting louder and louder and louder as the months and weeks went on. And especially after the press conference where they're like, hey, by the way, we have three unannounced uh, titles that are going to be remastered and, re and or remade. Definitely not going to be GTA after like these months of rumors. Haha, <laughs> wink, wink, nudge, nudge, not, not telling you anything. Uh, I'd say that for those that are skeptical about this, I get you. But it's definitely not one of those things where the source is going to be, trust me, bro. So yeah, hopefully we're going to be hearing more about this on an official side of things, of course, from Rockstar, hopefully very soon. I wouldn't expect like a big announcement in like months and or weeks leading up to this because all they have to do is like, by the way, guys, we're like remastering GTA 3, Five City, and San Andreas. This is the release date. This is where you can buy it. Uh, go crazy. And then they will, because even when this came out, 
uh, I was chilling in a pub in London um, and then by the time I saw it like three or four hours after it came out the internet had already exploded and everything was trending even GTA 6 for some reason because you know that seems normal and last but not least is also a very interesting thing that the Kotaku source is telling them is that the Rockstar also has plans to develop new ports of games like Red Dead Redemption 2 but the future of these remastered games will depend on how well the initial resale of the obviously remasters are going to be so if you want to see a Re the Redemption remake, I guess it's time to start pumping out some dollar bills towards these upcoming remasters because that's going to determine whether or not we're going to be seeing more of them. Very good stuff, very interesting, very excited and I'm very curious especially to see some screenshots and or gameplay of these new remasters and of course when they do come out I will try not to be on vacation then so I can actually bring out the video when it actually happens rather than a couple of days after. Sorry, I was on vacation. Please don't hate me for it. Still made the video regardless, hope you guys are excited just like I am. Of course, stay tuned to the channel for more news and good stuff about this, as well as Expanded and Enhanced, which should be coming out in a few months as well, where we haven't really heard anything about yet, and I'm getting really, really upset. Having said all this though, thank you all so very much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe for more, and if you really like what you see on the channel, consider becoming a member, like Chloe, Roberts, Loose Fire, Captain Price, Shakulu, and Dr. Strange Love. Join them and all the other fellow members by clicking the join button down below. Thank you again for watching, and I'll see you all later.